Okay, so we're going to be fully exploring this floor. This is an easy floor. And also, I mean, it seems the tentacles aren't here with us. We'd need to go up first, but then what's this area over here? And the music is kicking in really well as well. There are some uh, of the light orbs about the fragments, and yeah, as we were discussing earlier, the we're in a position where we'll have to come down here again later. To get to the you know the finale room but we have to leave here as well before we can actually do that so we're going to try and make sure we get all the fragments we can um, i'm very sure why the tentacles aren't out but it, i mean it's convenient at the moment i'm also interested to know whether i'm losing crystals or gaining crystals generally speaking as well i think we're, we're about even So rooms like this, I know that there's no, um, there's no like done little secret room to go down because there's not a double stack on the map. However, it's these things, and I don't really know what they do. But we try and kill them. Then I feel like there must be a reason, but I've just yet to to figure out or have any concrete indication of what they do. We are hungry again. So at this point, we have got to start thinking about... Um, we should probably eat stuff, because the food that we've got will be more valuable if we cook it as a... If we cook it. Whereas if we just keep nomming the little meats, then we're going to use more meat quicker. So we'll. Uh, I think we'll wait till we get to the next campfire, which is soon. Yeah, just south from here. The noise we're getting here is from the actual doorway. Okay. Let's go down. Yeah, so we're going to go ahead and we're going to do that. And then we're going to go into here. And I don't think we actually need to go to our hideout, but we just need to... Oh, we do. We do in order to get the water. We might keep every other, maybe, bonfire down here. So when we come down next time, we've got save points. Maybe I should have done that on this one. But we'll, we'll do it on the next one. It's, it's no big issue. We just want it to be kind of quick here, because we, we, I think we, this duration is probably still going to go down. So let's go for. Yeah, these are these are quite handy. Um, and we should get out of here now as well. Trying as quick as we can. Okay, down we go. Go okay, remember to put on my lantern, and I'm down there as well. Here we go. Hang on. I don't know. There, there's still no 
tentacles as of yet. Which is interesting. I mean, it makes it quite a lot easier. <laughs> but I don't want to speak too soon because they may come and start causing hassle. Or maybe it's intentional and the order in which I did things last time. meant that they were constantly out, I'm not too sure. This room just has a left, and bottom left way out. So I'm destroying them all rather than using a light because it seems to be the best way at the moment, especially since the tentacles aren't out, for me to replenish my stock of um, of the white crystals. Oh, food, food, food! No, 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 no! Come here, food. Okay, we got one and we can't loot it. <laughs> That's a shame. I forgot that there are food sources down here, though, so... I, mean, I guess that's a positive. Okay, we got a bunch of the little critters there, which is handy. We can leave this light on. I guess that's the other purpose of the light, right? It allows you to use items and consumables because it keeps it safe around you because the enemies can't get close to it. Okay, this we have an exit out to the bottom. Killing these enemies is less important. I'm not sure why I'm chasing them around. I need to be cautious for traps and stuff here. Are we actually, I don't think we've taken hits from these little things so far, which is quite handy. Because even though we've got the, the Dark Helm, which helps against these dark enemies. Um, so if they're all black, or the tentacles, they count as the, the dark enemies, from what I found. Probably those dark dogs as well. So we need to leave to the right, and we need to... I want to explore the bottom left of this region first. Before we do that. Okay, we took a hit there, but yeah, can you see it didn't... Hang on, is my armor equipped? I need to check that out, because I don't want to... Next time we get to a crystal... Oh, oh, it kills the little... <gasps> That's highly useful. Highly useful. We might get a full message soon. On the meat... Okay, good. So we needed to explore that to get the, the key for this floor. So that was, yeah, we went north when we came in. The way. Right, did we have the armor on? No, good. It's just they really don't do damage to us, these little things. Okay, I think we handled the trap as well, didn't we? So we should be fine to go quite quickly. I mean, I'm, I'm still pretty confused why the tentacles aren't out. Uh, we're going to go with it. I mean, there's not much we can do about it. Okay. I'm wondering, oh, we may not, we may need to go back up there. That's frustrating. I remember the, the shape of this is like a giant S, if I remember. Oh, here's a... Yeah, we're going to run up quickly, uh, back up to that room. Because I think it's like an S, which means that it's not going to connect when we go into this next room. Okay, seems we haven't missed a big one either. Uh, just to verify, if I go through this, if there's no connection up, we're going to have to run back because uh, there might be something useful in that room. Yeah, I think I'm quite happy with that. But my recollection is correct. So we'll run back, we'll run back. It's okay. 
We don't need the lamp to on at this point. So the negatives for us really here is the extra food or hunger. That we're going to waste doing this. I think we'll be we can run quite quickly though. I don't think since the the tentacles aren't out at the moment, it makes it at least we're not losing health and bandages. Which becomes quite a powerful uh, or an important resource in these areas. Well, typically at least. Okay. Um, up and then down. There still could be traps. I, I'm I'm trying to concentrate and make sure that ahead of me there's nothing that's going to insta-kill me. Those little, little rats I could have killed there. But for now, maybe we'll we get them on the way back anyway. Okay. Some more there for us. Okay, now we're full. We can start numbing some of these. Another crystal here. I really collect those crystals too well there, did I? But should be able to see them on the way back at least. Okay, so was it worth even coming here? It's just a room. There's no secret area in it, it seems. Or when I say secret, I mean those, you know, the little caves you can go into. However, it may be where the the giant crystal is on this floor. Not that I really get what they do. Yeah, it is. Right, we'll come back to that in a moment. Let me just quickly finish exploring. Okay. It's only really like charcoal, not even charcoal, embers, sorry, and um, stones you find down here. Okay, so it really depends, doesn't it? If those giant crystals do do something, then it was definitely worth coming. Or if not, it's a bit of a wasted backtrack. So, down at left. So I'm guessing the main kind of hazard for us, if we've um, if we've kind of secured the the trigger traps now, are those crystal-based traps. You could still probably easily run on those if you're not concentrating. So let's try to just get through here quickly. Oh, it's, oh, it's bottom left. I thought we were looking for an exit bottom right. I'd, This time there. Yeah. It's just a quite little quick route we can take here. Uh, straight to the right. That should take us back to the big ice kind of platform room. And then we're back to where we were. There we go. Okay. Okay. Let's take that off for now. How's our hunger and stuff? Hunger and thirst is a bit low. Okay. 
We do have a potion as well. Right. If we can just use one potion on this floor. I think the next floor is the large floor, however. So we got to be careful if we're not using the campfire on this floor. Okay, we're just going straight to the right. Traps. This bit is so much <laughs> more relaxed without that. Without the, um, the tentacles. Like, it, oh, when I did the tentacles, when I did this area the first time, I hadn't completed the the icy um, kind of underground, weird, futuristic. Mysterious area, if you know which bit I mean. Um, so perhaps that has an influence on the amount of enemies we'll find down here. I don't know. The moment, though, we've only seen the tentacles once, which was after that bit. Okay, first time we've come across these. These are quite handy because they drop crystals as well. Okay, thirst is kicking in. Turnips, are they? Yeah, they are turnips. So turnips are quite good for thirst, but we're going to just go... Hmm. I'm going to take a turnip on its own, because we can... Um... You can eat those on their own, whereas the innards you can't. Even though this is a slightly better cut of meat, so to speak. Um, uh, we got caught a little bit there, but nothing too bad. might be coming to the end of this floor. Let's fight that little trap next to us. Make sure that is taken care of. Oh, there's food there. I don't want to jump into a trap chasing them. Though. We actually don't have room for food at the moment, so... It's not, we're not desperate to chase it. Okay, so that means the potion has just run out, I believe. So now our stats will start going down again, just because the, the heart icon showed at the top left. So I think that's what it means. So those take five hits at the moment, which is quite a lot. I uh, should be wary actually of replacing real food with mushrooms. You can't consume mute mushrooms on their own in this. They have to be cooked with something. And the white, I think those white mushrooms allow you to see crystals from further away, which is very minimal kind of benefit. I'm going to go out of the room and see whether or not the um, the meat stays on the floor if we left it like that. Because we're going to have to come back this way to leave. Okay, cool. This was worth coming to. I love how you can see the eyes of these creatures in th through the dark. Okay, 
nothing significant here. Okay, so there's a boulder blocking the way, it seems here. Oh, and we've got a chest. What have we got? Bandage. Oh, wow. Not even a good bandage either, come on. Did I not? Okay. I think it went a bit too far, unfortunately. But it's okay. Okay, so let's change weapon before we put something up. We've got a fragment. We've got a bonfire. I think we will, um, we could use this bonfire, actually, because there's going to be one more following. Let's see what armor's here. Okay, I have, oh, that's the crystal, I don't know what that one does. It's like called Shard Helm or something along those lines. Um, is our food going down in here? It is, oh, hang on, have we got water? There's no point in, um, lighting the bonfire if we don't have water. I can hear drips of water in here, but I don't think we've got water. No, so, um, let's save it then. Let's save it. I know we could, hmm. Actually. We can use the water in our sleeping place, can't we? Let's, let's do it that way. I'm thinking when I come back through here, I'm more likely to use the campfire between the two zones rather than come in extra room to come into this little cave. Especially if all the dark tentacles and everything's back as well. We we'll probably just want to run through as fast as we can when we come back in here. Okay, so let's get some water. Let's cook some stuff. Let's try and use some of the... We, we have to use mushrooms and things we can't eat normally, right? Gives us a bit of room for other stuff as well. Yeah, so I'm not sure what that void skull does. You can actually, we'd have to drop one to swap these pieces around. Might be worth doing them. Um, Just because I'd rather, I don't know what it is, but I'd rather figure out what that helm we just dropped is. So I'd rather keep that in case we die and we get ac we need to, to just kind of just oh, press start. And we want to discover what it does again later. Right, so that can hide in there for now. Um, we keep this on our person. Make sure these are still equipped. Yeah, still equipped. Great. Uh, do we need any supplies or to drop anything off? We don't use these. Let's get rid of those. No, it doesn't seem we've got anything of particular use at the moment, does it? Okay. Back we go. Oh, hmm. Mushrooms. We've got too many mushrooms. We're going to find more as well, you see, so I think we should maybe go for, get rid of that, get rid of that. That's what I'm thinking would be the best decision for now. Okay, back we go. So we need to go south, we need to go, uh, we're not going to use the campfire, and we're going to go down to the next layer, and the next layer I believe is the largest area of the underground areas. Let's get going. A good cave that though, you know, a chest. Um, a special kind of like armor chest thing and a light orb as well. You know, it should be two chunks of meat down here on the bottom ledge. Yeah, they're still sparkling. That's good. Okay. 
so down here is where we're gonna I didn't want to pick that up I just want to use the bloody key that was inconvenient imagine if you're getting chased by lots of enemies or if the tentacles were here Okay, so we're bypassing this. We'll save that for the next time we're down here. And well, will the tentacles be on this floor? I can't hear them yet. We might have quite a bit of luck, it seems. Start through going right, I guess. Oh, nice. <laughs> he backed up onto a spike. <laughs> That's how menacing I am. Okay, we can go up on this. I thought I could hear something. So my right headphone, I could hear a little noise, which was this key. So we will go back down there in a moment. We'll see what's up here first, though. Down to the right in here. So quickly have a nose about this side. Tickle my curiosity. Oh. I wonder how much damage that would have taken if I wasn't wearing a dark helm. I got hit by two of them at the same time. So you, you can use this beam as well. Um, as a means to do damage. I find it less effective. Oh yeah, this is such a different experience without the um, without the tentacles. If this this part is so it makes me so anxious normally. Because even though once you get used to the way the tentacles attack, it's still they still pretty much get you. <laughs> At least like once a floor I fell anyway. Okay, we're gonna go down or we can go right. I guess we'll go right and then we'll try and come back on ourselves if it doesn't loop around. Uh, we're gonna eat food for the sake of the hydration we get from it at the moment I think so um, let's get, I think thirst is going to be a bigger problem for us than food and spikes maybe we can never get too confident when you know you're just a slip of the finger away from walking onto a spike down. Okay, I don't think this is the south part of the room to explore. I think we can safely jump out of here. Hmm, you can go right again. This may be leading to, uh, like, a room. Like a single uh, room kind of exit where you'll come and have to backtrack in the end. There's quite a few valuable items you can acquire 
on these floors if you get into all of the little secret rooms. So it's it's valuable to explore them. It'll make bits easier as well. So these enemies that take five slashes now, we can acquire a weapon which will make it take a lot less than that. Oh. Okay, so it's not an extra room. Is this going to be the point where the big crystal is, like we've had on the other floors? Which I'm still struggling to understand the purpose of. Okay, so they take five normal hits. Oh, okay, no, there's a benefit here. I think, is that... Oh, no. I thought that was one of the fragments, but it's not. It's just the... The backdrop in here. So we were right. It's another one of these sections. If I understood their significance, it'd, it'd feel more rewarding when I get to. The point where I find them. nasty. Oh, I was worried I was going to get knocked back then by that hit and we could have gone into those spikes. Okay. I'll go straight back across then. Getting the shield out just in time. You can't really see the animation, but I'm holding... After my second slash, I'm holding shield. And it gets out just in time to block the... That attack. Turnips is good. Let's numb some of them. So yeah, it should actually be taking a lot of hits then. It's not really having a negative effect on us. So it should emphasize. So the fact I'm wearing the item, the Dark Helm, reduces the damage significantly I get from these things. And the second thing is there's normally tentacles constantly around you in here jabbing at you and they can really do a lot of damage uh, for some reason since we come into it I don't know if it's something I've done in the game or whether it's a bug or what uh, the tentacles aren't around us which is making it a lot easier for us so if you play this yourself or you hear people talking about how difficult this section is <laughs> I'd agree the first time I came here I <laughs> it was petrifying um, but it seems that now I'm more experienced, it's easier, but <laughs> this time the tentacles aren't even here. So that makes it significantly easier. Okay, we spotted the trap. Ooh! Good thing we found, did that actually. Come on. That flash still gets me every time. <laughs> Okay, it seems we may have missed one, based on the order which they filled in on the lantern. Which is a bit of a shame, if we have, but it could just be in the, on this floor somewhere else, though. We saw this trap. Let's not forget about it. I almost did as I was running out towards it then. Okay, so we've been in here already, haven't we? This is where we got the key from. Yeah. And then we go down left. So I'd say we've explored maybe around one third of this floor. It's quite a large floor. This it expands the same mirror, kind of that side. 
and then quite a lot below as well okay thirst is hitting us right now oh is that a okay we'll kill these and then we'll take eat some food did we blow this up remember I don't think we do I think this is yeah something else oh <laughs> I'm an idiot that's where we fell down <laughs> I thought we'd gone one screen further across nope that's where we fell down we can't do anything with that let's hope I don't regret wasting those arrows now north of here would be a similar layout to the opposite side we need the food at the moment we don't get much uh, hydration from a little eating the food but it's better than nothing Some mushrooms. We, okay, so we can. We need to leave here at the bottom left, so we should explore it around the opposite kind of sides first. But we have got two potions. Maybe I should use one of them. Actually, I think that would be a good idea. I thought we were down to one, I forgot we um, took that extra trip to the campfire earlier, didn't we? I oh, didn't get any of those crystals then. Turnips or items? Okay, turnips. I mean, okay, we'll take one more turnip for the road. And next time we get really low, I think we'll use a potion. Traps. Okay, we're gonna go south. There's two ways out of this room south and southwest. We're gonna go south so we can link up to the room that we previously kind of. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm just conscious of like lunging accidentally into. A trap. We got a lot of um, this light actually, so we can use it a bit more if needed. It's going to scout the room. Are we gonna? So there's a chest here. Are we gonna go back in here? We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to. We'll go left, then up, and then back out. We don't have to, but I mean, for me to search. Oh, what? It doesn't link. Oh, it might not link. Okay, we'll go up and round and take it from there. I think they were normal arrows. We're going to hold on to them because I did say on the way in that we might um, we might be in a situation where we need 
uh, arrows in order to open like a locked room. Yeah, uh, because you have the the types of room that are opened when you shoot the little glowing orange target next to it. So we're gonna keep hold of them for that reason. Oh, it does link up. <laughs> it's okay. I think this was a nicer decision to go this way anyway. I can see that trap. Don't worry. Don't worry. We got this. We got this. I thought I heard these little critters. Come here, fellas. Lovely. Uh, let's let's head over to the left and then we'll come back. Hmm, I'm getting hit quite a lot. <laughs> okay, we're regenning. Health, it seems, from our, our core attributes at the moment. Survival kind of stats, I mean, by that. Okay, what's over here? What sort of room is it? Okay, dead end. But, something useful, I'm sure. So before having the Dark uh, Helm, these element enemies are quite nasty. They can do a lot of damage. And if you don't learn their, like their attack rhythm or pattern, you can also, that combined with taking more damage from their attacks can be quite nasty. So, up here we have one of these. We'll come back and finish you in a moment. Get the most of the light for now. Is that it in this room then? Ay ay ay. The control of uh, left click to attack and right click to shield. It maybe it's common in other games, I don't know. I'm not a terribly experienced uh, gamer. But it feels really nice, it feels right. Oh, my words. I generally thought I was going to leap into that trap there, as you may have heard by the very sharp intake. <laughs> Panic air. That sounds like a terrible name for an airline. <laughs> Panic air. Oh, was this the meat chunks? No, we dropped. We, there were some meat chunks we left on the floor out here, I believe. Could have been down here? Nope. Okay, let's keep keep going. Uh, we need to go down. Not here. First again. It's one of the biggest problems. Ah, here's the meat. Okay, so this is good because it means that we can... Let's clear these out of the way first. We can eat. Oh, really? I just... These things are irritating. <laughs> I just want to eat. Give me a break. That's what the crystals are good for, we mentioned earlier, right? Is that it gives you that little bit of... break from the little critters in here so you can eat without taking more jabs. Okay, bottom... We're clearing quite well at the moment. Uh, it's very easy because of the... Well, compared to what it normally is, it's very easy because of the lack of tentacles. Did I just... I thought I heard one there. Should just melt this one away.
Now, is that going to fill the gap we had there, or is it... Yes, it is. Okay, cool. So we may not have missed one. Could just be the collection order. There's multiple on the same floor. I'm not sure how they... Um, kind of balance it. I do apologize for my um, my staggering of sentences. I don't talk like that in real life. It's it's just like when I try to concentrate and I'm conscious of dying, I don't want this this life to to be ruined by a careless death. So my my talking just kind of suffers. <laughs> This way we go. Oh, we're thirsty again. Oh man. Is it going to be worth this? How's our hunger? If our hunger's low as well, we can have the stew, I guess. No, our hunger isn't low. Have to make a decision soon on what we're gonna do with it. Now, unless there's a little room here, I think we're gonna have to choose. Oh, there is a little room here. Oh, and there's rats. Okay, that made the decision for us. We can loot the rats. Take their meat and use this to... Oh, this is just... These things are so annoying. Just let me eat. <gasps> Again, I thought I was going to jump onto that trap. My lungs are getting a good workout anyway. That's for sure. Okay, so we can... I might have gone too far for that. Oh, no, no, it did work. Let's finish exploring this room first before we go in. So we can then just leave and go to the... Right when we come out. Is there really a? St oh wow! We had to run into that stone very firm to get it out the way. Okay, good, 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 good. We can go back to base. We can drink up there. What are the items we got here? I mean, a skull and a flare. Bandage, explosive. Yeah, there, that's better stuff. Uh, hunger and stuff isn't locked here, so we need to be a little bit cautious. We still haven't got any string, so we can't really utilize what we'd like to. Uh, I don't think there's anything else under the flare. Yeah. So we'll drop that. Uh, what's this item as well? Ooh, is that dark armor? Okay, it might be. All right, we're gonna drop this. Or oh, maybe it's not dark armor. What is it? Shard armor. So we can take three hits. Okay, we'll we'll use that when things get messy later, or if things get messy later. Positive thinking. Right. So if we use this campfire, we're not using the next one. That's the plan. At this point, we might be able to use one of the save points as well, the, the checkpoints. We haven't actually set one yet. But... It'd mean coming back to this, the end point would be easier. Yeah, that's a very good point. It might actually be worth doing. Let's first do this. Um, let's cook as well. We got 
Mm. Let's get those cooked up. We don't have more room to store that stuff, actually, so... We just kind of... Gotta go with it, really. Uh, okay, dropping those items there was a bad idea. We should put them... Somewhere that we're not going to accidentally collect them. Uh, yeah, no, I'm happy to keep those items. We're relatively low on the bomb arrows. So we need to play very carefully with those now. Or find string. Okay. Let's get going. I think we can jump out of here. And we'll set this as a waypoint. So that we can get back to this floor. Because I think this floor is where we need to come back to. It's very dark. <laughs> we might need the stick. I didn't mean to pick up the skull, but we can live with that. We can live with that, right? Where were we? We need to go down and right. Let's drop the skull. Careful around these things. Okay, let's not bother getting too close to that to collect those crystals. Of him. Okay, so down is going to be out. Up is going to take us to a certain area that we can't open yet. I say this as if I haven't been talking about spoilers throughout the game. So no, it takes us to the, the end, basically, right? But we need the lantern complete in order to... Where does that fragment fit in here? Nice, 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 okay. We're doing very well with the fragments as well, I believe. Don't think we've missed any obvious ones. So I think this... Um, This is the big guys platform, I believe. But we're not gonna. Yeah, we can, there's no point going there yet. We'll probably just freeze anyway and die. Also, something like that could be a trigger to bring back the tentacles as well. I didn't even think about that. But hey, if they come back, then it's good. They meant to be down here. They meant to be scaring us. It's fine. We've got to come back into this room, so we'll explore the south side of it when we get back. Oh, you take... He's up to six hits. I thought it was five there. That was bad by me. I think I'm out of safety. We might just 
um, bandage up as well. Just in case we get into a, surrounded when we need to bandage and we can't for that reason. Spikes on the right, we just spotted. So careful with these. But yeah, as I said, when we're coming into here, those spikes are always on a little platform like that, which make them a lot easier to, to find. further this direction we got this is it okay cool but well, this could be where we get one of the good items I believe which will make clearing a bit quicker as well So the only way to kind of stop yourself from drawing an arrow is to dash and it cancels it. Hmm. So no good item as such, it's just a little checkpoint. Okay. That's okay. Maybe it's a chance they can spawn, I'm not sure. Or maybe it's Maybe it's not actually on this floor. Cool, I think we've cleared that then. So down to the next floor, we go. I think we got the key for this floor quite early on, didn't we? Oh, we. There's one more down to the bottom left before we head down and out. But yeah, I think it was quite early on when we found the key, so we should be fine to get out of here. It's like they're a little cautious, these, th these guys. They don't quite want to attack me while I'm cutting open a little rat. They'll nip at my heels whenever I look vulnerable. Okay, we're thirsty at this point as well. Might be water up ahead, we'll, we'll see. Between floors, I don't think there is for sure, but... I'm pretty sure there isn't. How is that one still alive? Alright, see you later. So, we don't have water, but we are hungry, so it's going to be a, an opportunity to take one of our stews, I believe. Green elixir. Well, that, mm. Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. That, that means you get excess crystals, or double the crystals, I think. 
from enemies. Which is good. Oh, enemies straight on me trying to attack before I've even landed. It's nice, isn't it? Out from oh wow. Okay, there's a crystal there. We should probably just do that instead. <laughs> That'll help, eh? A nasty entrance that area though. Okay, we can go left and right or down. Okay, we've sent the large crystal on this floor. Going top right, what have we got? Two directions to go right or down. Cheeky little. So the reason I'm not clearing the runes fully is because I do think we'll be backtracking along here. However, it is easy for me to forget to go back into that room. So I should be more careful. And at least shine the light around to make sure I'm not missing a fragment. Double. It would seem. Right, let's go through. And could have easily run out of arrows. Oh, nice, nice. Okay. And this chest. And these, some of these rooms are really, really valuable. I'm realizing at this point as well. We, if this is an item, we or armor, we may need to drop more. Um, what are we getting from it? Oh, no, it's the sword. And this sword is brilliant. It makes the process of defeating those enemies. I've just been slaying. Instead of taking six <laughs> hits, it gets to a point where I think it's one or two hits. It may only be effective against dark uh, enemies. I'm not sure the like how it works mechanically. but Okay, we're going to numb a bit more, because we seem to be a little bit hungry, uh, thirsty as well. Let's get rid of those. There's no water in here, is there? No. It's the main resource we're short of. Um, so these should be one hits now, yeah. Which is very nice. Seems very dark in here. <laughs> um, it's just bottom left is the way out we want here. It does seem you have the same kind of base attacks with this weapon. When I initially found it the first playthrough, I thought, is this, um, you know, will it attack faster? Will it have a, a different kind of attack pattern? But it just seems to be the same, but 
strong though. I mean, I kill those things in one shot now. Which is wonderful. So, okay, we're actually quite fortunate. Do you remember I hadn't explored fully the, the room in the south? Uh, the, sorry, the room, the south part of the room in the north is what I'm trying to say. And so this configuration means that we do actually go back up this way. Which means we will explore it. Which is good. I don't think there's anything really here anyway, but... Okay, this left side. This floor is going to be much longer either. This, uh, I'm trying to see where we are. So we've been here, you can go straight down. We're going to check out the left side and then we're going to go straight down. I think we still need to find a key as well, so exploration is important. Just for a moment, we're going to... Just check out this side of things. I think we will go for a stew soon. I do think we're going to have to explore a little bit for a, a bit longer than a couple of morsels is going to keep us. There's a spike back there, so we need to be careful. Oh, that enemy who's backtracking constantly is doing my head in. There we go. We got it. We got it. Get out. Well, we got a torch. Just a torch. Uh, so top left is where we want to be going. Okay, now I could get distracted and... Yeah, we could have had first issue, so I want to make sure that we didn't do something silly. What's this room look like? Okay, down or or left. It's so much easier being able to kill those in one shot now. Or oh, well, at least in one lunge. I'm not sure if it's one normal slash, but if you like do the jump attack at them, they go down, which is great. We're going to go left. I expect the same layout to what we had before. So we could probably go left and down and yeah, and connect back. Yeah, so they still take two normal slashes, those guys. But it essentially means that this is. Three times more powerful than the regular sword. Against this type of enemy, at least. Okay, I don't think we can go any further that way. Let's get going. Okay, this does connect downwards now. See him coming. My attack animation meant I couldn't block though. Which is fair. Which is fair. So, bottom right, wasn't it? We're trying to go here. Yeah. Here. 
Ooh, okay. Okay, that's it. That's the, that's the end of this floor. Seems to be getting pretty close now. Have we found a, a key for here? No. Is it in this room? I sincerely hope it is, because we've explored what I thought was everywhere. But we may have not got the key somehow. It's disappointing. Okay, we haven't got the key. Let's go find it. So these are the kind of stone slabs we're going to be looking for here. We didn't come through this room here, so it could be here. I think we may have just missed it as well, though we have... Let be... Often in like edges of room, of rooms that you don't have to go to otherwise. Oh, and we're thirsty again. This is getting stressful now. Okay. Oh, there was only one way through here, wasn't it? Okay, we're gonna have to eat for thirst. I just hope we don't have to eat everything while we go around and look for this. Alright, let's just run ignore the enemies. We'll go we'll go the left way round and everywhere and then we'll turn right. My gut feeling says it's right actually, but Ah, there, there, there. I should have known, actually, because we didn't use this door. Yeah, this connection there. It was the one place we didn't know. If you remember when I was doing the opposite side, I said it's, it's susceptible to forget to go and explore that bottom way. I think we'll be okay to get down to the campfire so we don't need to waste more food for hydration here. I believe so. Here we go. Okay, cool. So we need, we definitely need to drink, so we're gonna have to use this checkpoint here. Um, we need a drink and we need to create two new potions to crack on with as well. So let's go sleep. Let's get this. Right. Do we want just some good food? I think we're gonna. We'll do a bit of both. We might want one that just replenishes everything, so. Just gone, ah, that could have been interesting as well. We'll take one of those for now. With us. We start wearing the armor soon if we're gonna get concerned as well. 
cool. We've increased our storage in here. We've got three of these arrows left. Start storing quite a few. We don't know you use those bandages so much. Normal arrows can go there. Uh, health items can go here. The leather is used as a health item at the moment. We don't particularly need the stick in that. We can drop those if we run out of space. Okay. Um, are we ready? We're running out of supplies, we definitely are. Let's go. Three bits of food, two potions. Let's hope it's enough. It's a small floor compared to the rest. Then we've got the ending bit as well to deal with, so. Oh, when I say ending bit, I mean the the final floor, if you will. Okay, we've got spikes ahead. Let's be careful of them. The spikes that side. Let's go deactivate those while we remember. We know the exit is south, but we are doing a, a full little search, it seems, of the floor, so. Made a lot easier by the lack of um, tentacles still. We must remember that. It's peculiar that they haven't. They're not here. Oh, turnips. Oh, he's a little cheeky. Alright, down we go. Down we go. What layout have we got here, left or right? Gonna go left. I remember this room, I don't remember it. Our chest, we've got some spikes over there. Oh, we should destroy this. <laughs> that shield out but was facing wrong way then. Oops. There's a junction we're going to have to come back through. I think it is. Time is quite precious. Time. Food is the main thing for us, I think, at the moment. So I should try and be a little quicker with what I'm doing. I think there's a key on this floor as well, so it's important we do search. Or else there's a chest here at least. Up we go. Up here, eh? Okay, room on its own. Nasty trap. Oh, that could be the final one down here as well. Because uh, I think I know what the last one is. The one on the right. Yes. Okay, we're doing good. We're doing good. Probably not much else in here, but it could be the key. You know, you don't get any crystals if you leave the light on, so... I'm gonna kind of make that trade off. 
Whether you want extra light or whether you want to get the crystals back from it. The moment we've got a lot, so I'm okay using that light. Keep the enemies stopping from chasing me. Just let me loot things easier and make it a little less frustrating. Okay. So let's go around. So, well, I can't remember the layout. Part of me says I should probably go left, but uh, maybe it's a it's a diamond shape. And it might not wrap around naturally. We prefer that rather than having to backtrack, but we'll do what's needed. Oh, I think we, we went down here, didn't we? Yeah, we have been down here. Where am I trying to get to? Bottom right. Good, 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 good. What have we got here? Yeah, okay, so we can go down here. Looks like there's just two rooms to the right where we can loop back to where we started. I think there may be a key there for us because we haven't found a key. And you do you need a key for this one? Uh, it might just... No, you need just the light on it, you do. I remember this bit being terribly, terribly hard <laughs> with the tentacles chasing you because you need to shine the light on that door while there's a massive swarm of tentacles just underneath you waiting to poke you when your guard's down. I don't mean a gentle poke either. Okay, so we can go up the top of this room as well. Careful now, we're getting close. That's why we step around so cautiously constantly. Okay, we're getting hungry. We need some turnips. What the flip? That was a nasty old start screen, right? Oh, is that all that's in here? Have I not have I discovered that room before? That's crazy. It's a nasty old room that is. No, I don't think I have come across that room before. That was great. I mean, it would have been t terribly unfair if I had no way to defend myself, you know, but I think it worked well. If I had the other sword, I'm not sure. Maybe I would have taken a few hints. I mean to go down there instead of I did, I did. That's a mistake. Get out of here quick. Oh, it's actually up, isn't it? There we go.
So I had a very unfortunate death the first time I came down here. But it was perfectly designed to kill me that way. <laughs> I remember it well. So the building on the left. Just don't be too greedy. That's the advice. And give this someone new playing it. Okay, first is an issue. I think there is a teleport out of this area as well that will take us back to the main beach. So that will allow us to go and uh, restock some things. We could even potentially go and... Um, uh, farm a little bit of food from some of the easier le uh, levels, perhaps. Before we go into the last bit. Because I think we, we will need food and potions. And maybe the little ice hat has... <gasps> Do you see I almost did it again? Oh my words, that's the exact bit I was on about. <laughs> that would have made me very sad, considering I said it. Literally less than a minute ago. What items have we got that we can drop here? What was that we got then? Wow, okay, good armor. I guess at this point we could wear that. Okay, we're, we're hungry. We're going to go ahead and yeah, we'll keep the full stew. Because I know the stew keeps uh, brings back your warmth. I think the potions do, but I'm not sure. Not 100%. So, um, and I know there's going to be some iciness to one of the areas we still need to get to. So. <laughs> I got so close to, to dying there in the, the most silly of ways. Fancy lands. I guess we'll drop this now. So this is a crystal lance. I have no idea what it does differently, if I'm honest with you. Um, I tried playing with it a bit. I'd never quite figured out what it does differently, other than glow. It glows very nicely. Which I valued. <laughs> One more building to enter on the far right. So I hear little squeaks, but I can't really see any my uh, any of the little mice. Hmm. <laughs> well done. Have I missed the right building, or no? More items that we don't have room to store. What is in this one? The shield! Okay. Shield is good, but um, what are we going to drop for this? A bit <laughs> it's a bit frustrating. And I guess we will lose this. I was saying we have less use for it. The crystal shield. You always have your shield out. Um, and this maybe takes less knockback. I never quite figured out the exact differences other than the fact that it glows. So now we have the choice. We can go into the last place. Well, I say final place. There's more than one final place, isn't there? We can go to the the second um, of those underground mysterious areas. Um, 
but I think that's that's the place we're probably most likely to die on some of the traps as, as you run through there. So I'd prefer to be better equipped for that. Because our stash at the moment isn't as good as it could be. So I think we will make the most of... This... Which should take us back to the beach, I believe. Yeah. And I think we're going to just try and go and get a little bit of food from... Oh, yeah. Do we go to some of the rats, or do we... Hmm. Not sure what the best way to do this is going to be. Because the, there's always the danger, and I've, I've done this quite often, where... The process of trying to <laughs> go and get food will cost you more food than what you actually earn. Uh, the fishing can be a good source of food. I should have remembered that. Because um, th there's ponds which you can kind of farm up a bit if you need. But we're going to just go inside and hope there's some rats that we can... And some bats, perhaps. Just get a few more things stocked up. Make a potion, fill our bags, and then we'll get going. Oh, and also, no, we should we should go do this while we're on the on the way, shouldn't we? Yeah, maybe we'll do that. We'll go to the the place that needs two hundred tokens at the same time. That seems sensible, actually. I mean, it was the plan all along. It wasn't me being scared of one, not wanting to die. I'm pretty sure we've armed all the traps in here. Um, or triggered, I should say, I think, rather than armed is what I'm trying to say. Oh, if we come across any of the... Um, the blood mosses as well, they'll be very useful. So down right, I believe, we need to go here. Yep. Yeah. I haven't seen any critters yet. We could also do with some string. Oh, there we go, critter. Where are your friends go, huh? Normally travel in a little group, but right bottom right again. Nice. This is where we needed to come. We full inventory, are we? Uh, let's drop some of the things we care less for. Mm. Might actually need the leather. Where's the? That's what we wanted. Oh! Did I catch him? No. Did I just run past the exit? I think I may have. Or no, no, no. There's a. It's one of those where the map. There's one of the few instances where the map makes you think, ah, this. You go down from here. Almost always is at the bottom of the actual screen, but not in this instance. I earned much food yet. Right, so we want to go to this room down here. So down, down, bottom left, bottom left, up. Bottom left, bottom left, was this, yeah? 
-hmm. And one more bottom left, and then we go up. Oh, come on, Dan. <laughs> Quite difficult to catch these little fellas. Okay, yeah, this is where we needed to come. I know that we haven't especially caught much more food, but maybe we're just gonna have to. Use the word brave it loosely here. Now, <laughs> I want to press stall. Stall would make sense, right? But part of me worries that would somehow take 400 of mine. So we're going to play it more safe. And just hold down E for a little while and get this uh, filled up. Oh, we're hungry again. Such an appetite. Okay, so this shop is good. Because also, well, we have some items. Which are good. But, this fragment is more important. Because now we've got all of the outer fragments. It's just the inner fragments we haven't got. And they get, um... Actually, uh, yeah, yeah. So the crystal helm here is one of the good ones, but we don't actually need it right now, and we have no space for it either, so I'm actually going to leave it where it is. Oh, oh there's a... <laughs> I didn't... <laughs> I didn't... No, there's a marble in there. It's interesting. Okay, I don't think there's anything else here. Oh, what did I buy? Oh, I've done that before. I was trying to interact with what was in there. Okay, that's fine. I think we're gonna we're gonna use this campfire. We're gonna go into our cozy base. We're hunting the last marble, or that marble. It may not be the last one. I'm not sure if I've collected them all. Uh, cook some food. The last of the food we've got. One, two, three. One, two, three. This one, we, we're going to make it one of those potions to stop stats falling down. We're hungry already. Which means we might actually um, consume one of these now as well. So we might make this now and then we'll consume it in a second and then make a new one and then we'll get going so now we can store another one of these oh did we want to take that we, I think we did as an altar if it gets cold or wait and we, we're running out of yeah, that would be more sensible. Okay, so you go here. Let's cook one more thing. Okay. Oh, did I use the wrong type of mushroom? I did. <laughs> Blast. I don't think... Did I not have the right type of mushroom? No, we didn't. Okay, that's fine. So it wasn't the wrong type. I didn't. I didn't have it. I just uh, made a mistake of what it would do. So we can make a bandage as well with this. It's good. 
Uh, we're going to go ahead and place... Use the real bandages now. Uh, these little ones we can get rid of. I think we'll keep extra ones of those. They're more useful. I think we can craft another one, can't we? Yeah, like so. Yeah, we're low on arrows, but it's fine. Let's do this then. Still not full on food. So we need to go back to the beach, down to the bottom place, go inside, don't die. It's the best way out here. I don't know. Bottom will take you to the ice cave. I think the ice cave has an exit. Oh, no, it doesn't. It just takes you in and in. I think we're going to have to go back the same way. This is the quickest way back to the beach. Snake! Oh, little critter as well. This is this is better. We found as much food in this one room as we did on the whole way in. Okay, this makes me think we can survive better now. If we find more. Okay, so at this point we can There's two ways that we can get back, right? So we didn't come this way last time, we manually went up the stairs. But this if we go into the building takes us to an ice cave. If we go at the top it takes us back into the beach at the second level, which would then take us back to the beach. Uh where you spawn. So yeah, I think that's the the route we're gonna take. We don't need to go into the ice cave. This takes us back out to the beach. Excellent, okay. I'm still pretty sure we can't catch fish. I think I got rid of my harpoon as well, didn't I? Oh, that's a bit unfortunate. Did I? I did. I'm pretty sure we don't need the hammer for anything as well. So that's a poor choice.
Okay, so we need to teleport back to that end bit. Um, and then we'll go in to try and claim one of the central lantern pieces. So we'll uh, we'll stop this video here, this episode, and we'll continue this and finish off, hopefully, without any deaths um, in the next Let's Play. Just have a quick look of where we're at. Um, as far as the map goes, we've pretty much ex we've explored everywhere exhaustively, which is nice. Um, and we're now down to this final area. We have one or two small things left to do. Uh, in terms of inventory, we have ourselves a little bit of food, enough of two more potions. We've got quite a bit of health we can regen. Not much explosive arrows. And we're quite well equipped other than that. We might equip this as well. Get ourselves ready. Oh, we did have another marble. I didn't hand it in. Okay, we'll have to remember that next time. But there we go, yeah. Thank you very much for watching. I'll be back with the final episode soon. Take care.